wanted to share something with y'all while it's fresh on my mind. I'm going to be sharing what a snippet of code looks like from the DNA right next to a snippet of code from a computer program to show you how those actually look similar. Now the DNA is far more complex than a computer code and so what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to show you some of the geometries of electrons and atoms and I'm going to be showing you the way that those are actually these very complex geometries that are amazing. So I'm going to show that side by side. So just as the people who believe in the Big Bang, if you back up, everything actually winds down to a singularity to where everything is believed to have been wrapped up into one. And I don't really try to go into that very in depth, but just with that same principle, the way that time and matter and energy all go into a place that is indescribable, uh, that is a bit how science is going when they're looking into these atoms and the DNA and just how complex that is. And for example, if you look down into an atom, there's a place where time and energy and matter are all wrapped into one as well. And sorry if I'm misstating things, but that's why it's interesting to look into these things a bit. Well, I would be speaking of the quantum level right now. So I hope that this is interesting. And like I said, I probably didn't say everything exactly right, but that's why we research and study to find out more. And I'm making a note here also, not only for y'all of what I'm going to do, but also for myself. So, all right. Thanks for watching. Bye.